We're taking a look at some of the critical features of a linear guide carriage. Carriage assemblies, such as those shown in the photograph below, contain sets of recirculating ball bearings. What we're checking is that the ball bearings move in a straight line along the rails of the carriage and that opposing carriage rails are parallel to each other. The measurements take place as follows. Firstly, the PGI Novus automatically aligns the rails. Next, the lower and upper rails are measured using the dual bias gauge. This is shown in the photographs on the right. And finally, the data is analysed and the results are shown. For this application, we're using PGI Novus and Metrology 4.0 software. To start with, the PGI Novus automatically aligns the lower rail. Once aligned, a set of traces is taken along the length of the lower rail. The gauge switches automatically then to reverse bias and a set of traces is taken along the length of the upper rail. The measurements are complete. For the analysis, ball contact points and centres are found for each trace, and this information is used to determine the straightness, PCD and parallelism of the guide rails. Thank you for listening.